Hello, mods and fonts, and welcome to another very exciting Bubba's Bar Plays Badly. And today we're playing Family Feud on the Xbox Series X. Uh, I know, the future is here, and the future is playing Ubisoft quizzes uh, on a massive Xbox. So let's get into it. <clears throat> uh, we're playing this by myself today as we're uh, out to film this in the morning and people at work and that sort of thing. But it's not too bad, it's alright. Um, as you can see, it's by Ubisoft for Jeopardy and Wheel of Fortune games. And Slap Figure Click, who we uh, may better know as the uh, people want it's quiz time uh, of various plays badly fame. Plays badly's fame. Um, just cycling through this. It's very exciting. Anyway, here we go. Family Feud. I haven't, haven't localised it for the UK, uh, so I call it Family Fortune. It's Family Feud. But it's got it's got the uh, it's got the theme tune. <coughs> uh, so this is actually not that bad. Um, also, they, they've, they're selling it at £16, which seems a bit more reasonable compared to the 30 quid they tried to get Jeopardy and Wheel of Fortune earlier. Um, but just... Uh, so... You want to see options? Uh, there's options. So there are, there, are, there are various things here. Uh, let's go straight into the game. That's probably easy. It's customised you can customise your avatars. Um, we're going to play Classic Against Computer. Uh, Party battle on couch versus couch. Um, these are if you have a lot of people in the room in real life. Um, or you can play couch versus couch with one player. But if you want to play Family Feud in, in sort of a real life setting or indeed over online, uh, that's perfectly fine. The way it works is the game um, plays out, first 300. And then that fast money, um, the, t the team with the most points going into it gets the first go. So Nick's all the best answers basically. And the team going into it uh, second place uh, has to do the best they can, uh, giving all the good answers they've gone already, uh, which is quite interesting and fun. Uh, couch is couch, which is the, the same way. Uh, live show, broadcast the game live, and let, that's, that's sort of a Twitch um, experience, uh, which if you played It's Quiz Time, uh, you may have seen. Um, but we're not going to do that because we're thick. So we're going to go into classic mode. Uh, I'm going to play, you can, you can share a controller, or you've got multiple controllers, you can share them around. I'm going to play by myself, and I'm going to play as uh, him, Hiya. and uh, I'm just going to play by myself. Uh, done. And I've got, what do you think about medium and hard? So I'm going to play this easy family, because I want to make sure to, I want to get to fast money. So I can show you how that works. Uh, if you play against computers, you lose the main game, then uh, you don't even get to see that. Afternoons are always better with some family view. Well. And here's our host. It's not Steve Harvey, it's Lucky McCoy. They replayed up the cheese factor, and I think they've, they've gone with it, and it works quite well. It's me, Lucky McCoy, the super host that boasts the most. He's sort of a bit rubbish, but sort of play into that. Got two families ready to feud it out Big arm movements. Taking this game on solo. And you can't skip any of this, by the way. So, um, this is probably my All biggest bugbear. It, it can be quite slow. Lead. But it is quite slick. We always say, do the show. And we're getting a show, pretty much. Popular answers to our survey questions. Whichever team does the best will compete in fast money, where they could win our grand prize of $20,000. Now that we're and a here, car. How about we play some Family Feud? Get used to his movements. We sing him a lot. Off. Let's get someone from each family down in front. Like it was skip there. Yeah. It's me against the hipster. This time we've got six answers to find. When you have an answer to our survey, buzz in as fast as you can. Whoever finds the top answer first gets to decide if they want to play or pass. 100 people gave us an answer to this question. Name something from your childhood that you just won't throw away. Ooh. Go for it. 
Uh, I used to have a blanket, but I did throw it, throw it away. So, there you go. What you do is you, you type it in, and then options come up, and you just press the one that fits. Okay, then. And as you can see, it's all fully voiced. So, the host has the questions, blanket. and the answers. Well, that's, that's impressive answer, stuff. Six, those are top to us for toy, isn't it? Hey there. Looks like it's your this turn. is apparently the easy family, so presumably Name you'll do quite badly here. Childhood that you just won't throw away. Trophies. Think, huh? Could it be up there? Let's find out. Trophies. Wow. Good try. But it doesn't be oh, I suppose saying that, I've still got my national record of achievement from 20 years ago. Um, I'm going to play this one. You want to play. And then next time well, I'll pass, I can show what happens when you pass. Yet. So, uh, let's go for toys then, as you think that's going to be the top answer. Uh, yes! Did our survey say it? Toys! Absolutely amazing. Uh, the judging is its usually quite lenient. Uh, it's quite good for alternative answers. So if you say toilet, I mean, I'll just bathroom and accept that. But I had a, a very strange thing the other day, where, um, in practice yesterday, where um, I'm trying to have an answer now. Um, let's try certificates. Um, oh, that's not there. Um, uh, clothes won't be there, I don't think. We be surprised it would be there, anyway. Uh, oh, the question okay. was, name something you wouldn't want to see in your that cat's litter tray. And I said coins, and that was, oh, was there. And that was there. Nice that wasn't there. Uh, and the other team said bills, and that wasn't there. But then some said money, All and that right, was there. So well. that seems a bit of a shame. Um, right, what else did you throw away? Uh, photos? Photographs, there we go. Sure thing. Let's see if you're right. Oh, this is good. Now, what's the last yeah, answer going to be? Oh, yeah. Um, ugh. Name something from your childhood that you just yeah. won't throw away. Letters? Which one letters? Nice. Nice. Time to check the board. Letters. No, it's a first strike. Sad family so feud rules. Three strike. strikes and you're out. Oops. Um. What do you think? We need another answer. Uh. Parents. As you can see, I'm playing on my own. Cause that's because that's because all my family are dead. Good answer answer <coughs> accepted. Show me the answer. It's a very progressive version of family food, really. Parents. No, not there either. Ouch! Another strike. Um. If you get this, hey, the beliefs. Why not? Yours. If not, the other family might steal it. Uh, let's see if it's there. If it's up there. I'll give you the money myself. Uh, Blues and uh, Belizeans is that'll do. <laughs> That's what you're going with? Can't think of anything else. Let's see what the survey says. Surprisingly, not there. Bad news, folks. That's three strikes. Now There's this being the, the easy family, they'll probably mess this up. If you want to steal this round, you need to find me a missing answer. Here's your chance. You can do it. Ooh. Baseball cards. Let's see if it's there. I'll be surprised Baseball if it's there. Cards. Oh, it's not there. They couldn't do it. Uh, there are fifteen hundred questions in this. You'll see ten a game, up to ten a game, five in fast money, and then up to five in the game. You play single, single, double, triple, sudden death. And it's first to three hundred to win. What came in sixth place? Uh, you also have triple money in the UK. Jewelry, Jewelry obviously. How are our families doing? Let's see. I'm not going to say who I'm rooting for, but their initials are. 
Anyway, I'm winning. That's good. Get your game faces on, because it's time for the face-off. Can I have a person from each team join me over here? It, it's on television. It's a lot quicker because I think because everyone knows what's about to happen, so it just jumps up, don't they? <clears throat> this time you've got six answers to six find. Six to find. Here we go. Alrighty then. Buzz in first to get a shot at the top answer. Let's go. One hundred people. We ask them the following: Name someone in your life. Who usually does more talking than listening? You're in first. Uh, girlfriend. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Let's run with it. As a homosexual. Spouse. Spouse. Fair enough. That's that's it's pretty correct, more twenty twenty, isn't it? <clears throat> We're still looking for the top answer, by the way. Name someone in your life who usually does more talking than listening. I don't know. Teacher. Neighbor, that's a, that's a pretty good answer, probably. The survey says, neighbor. Oh, yeah. interesting. You're wrong. Decision time: Will you play or pass? Right, so I'm going to pass this one. So I'm going to show you what you can do whilst the other team are playing. Yes, they don't like their chances this time. <clears throat> Have you got something for us? So, um, it will, it will, the computer will go down the line and get like a couple of second. grandparents. Interesting. Uh, and it plays as as it would play normally, but whilst they're answering, uh, I could put in suggestions. So let's put a suggestion in, and then at the end of the uh, period, well, normally I could put in suggestions, but I can't today for some reason. Great stuff. But the idea is, certainly when you play couch versus oh, couch, yeah. um, right. whilst your the opposing team Name is uh, is doing stuff, you can put in answers in a list, and then at, at the end, when it's when it's your uh, your turn to come up with something to try and steal, you can just pick wise answers. Which is quite neat. It's quite clever. And if any answers come up that um, that uh, go up on the board. Or us or, or wrong, uh, it will blank them out for you automatically. And the other family gets to try for a steal. Which I'd like to have to show you, but I can't, unfortunately. That's your answer. And our survey says best friend. Way to stay in the What's game. the top answer? Ooh. I'm trying to think of something All myself right, and I can't. Okay, sure. What did our survey say? Kids. This game is not over yet. It's not over yet. Name someone in your life who usually does more talking than listening. Ah, uh, yes. Survey I mean, I think I'm going for teacher. Doctor. But... I don't know. Oh no! Strike three. Oh, nice. ho. our other family has a chance to steal. Um. Okay. All we need is one answer, and this family can steal the round. Uh. All right. Well, we'll put it anyway. Points and give yourselves a great chance. I'm not increasing. I imagine when that top answer is revealed, I'm going to be very, very. Myself. I see where you're going with this. Let's check the board and see if it made it. Teacher. No. That's not it. Can't believe I lost 51 points there. You nailed down this round. Now it's time to see what you missed. Number five. What are you? Myself. What? Let's see the number one answer. Parent. Huh. Here's how the scores are shaping up so far. It makes sense, really. I think my grandparent was was disallowed. That's all I'm saying. 
Uh, you probably assume parents will, but no, apparently not. Anyway, it's time for double points. Nowhere near as painful. Just like double money, but double points. All right, people, get up here and do your families proud. Come on. What part of camp? Everyone's got quite camp walk, haven't they? We want the top four answers to this question. Ooh, things are heating up. Points are doubled now. Ooh, indeed. We took a survey of 100 people, asking them, name a word that rhymes with nurse. Fast fingers, my friend. Feeling confident? Purse. Surely his top answer. Interesting answer. Let's take a Surely. Look. Yes. Top of the board. Play or pass. Uh, I'm gonna play. You're gonna come out swinging to win this round. Time to search your mind for an answer. Okay, curse. We got this one. Okay. Could it be there? Curse. Second, surely. Right. There it is. Verse. Ah. We need another answer from you. Uh, okay. Are you sure about that? Did anyone in the survey say this? Oh what? Come on. That's not up there. So here uh, right. Slide. So, first, curse, curse, yes, first. Name a word. Curse. With nurse. Uh -huh. Just. Less. Mers. Purse. Terse. Let's try terse. All right, it's spelt. Uh. Differently, that didn't really work with verse. Let's see but, uh, that's a good answer. Let's find out. Oh, come on. Another strike. Oh, no. Get another strike. Um, Your family will get a chance. Oh. I don't know. I mean, verse is there. We can try diverse. Oh, it's not there. That's a uh, bad form of 2020 Ubisoft. Um, reverse. That's not even an option. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm genuinely drawing a blank here. The other family gets a chance to steal. If they can find just one answer, this family will steal the board. Give How hard answer. could this be? Right, what are the answers going to be? I'm going to be very, very annoyed, I think. Hearse. That's good. Yeah? Did our survey agree? Hearse. Right, there's no way, right, that fewer people said verse and hearse, frankly. Is what a winning family looks like. There's only one answer left over. Reveal number four. Whatever. Worse. Worse. Right. Before we start another round, let's find out who's on top. Let's talk, let's not talk about that. Anyway, it's time for triple money, uh, which I probably need to win, actually. Humiliatingly. So there's the easy family. The top five answers are on the board. The stakes are getting higher because we're now tripling the points. Woo. We asked 100 people this question. Tell me something people have a hard time closing. 
You're in first. What you got? Uh bank account. Okay. And what did our survey say? Bank account. Come on. Unlucky. I'm gonna need your guess. Tell me something people have a hard time closing. Lead. Understood. Yeah, fine. Makes sense. Let's see it. Well, opening, Great. surely. All right. The answer is on the board. You can play or pass and force the other family to play. Well, they want to pass. One wants, wants to play. They don't want to play. Okay, so right. It looks like you'll be taking this one on. Oh, good. Guess what? We need an answer. Um, a relationship? Let's try it. Our survey said relationship. No. Uh oh, mm. it's not there, and that means you've got yourself a strike. Oh. I mean, technically, it's in my best interest to throw this, so you can't go over three hundred. Um, but we'll, we'll we'll do it anyway. Uh, book. Said with confidence. Is it on the board? Book. Right, my dog is barking, forgive me. Sorry about that. Anyway, um, where were we? <coughs> Tell me something uh, that was a time closing. Um my mouth. Feeling lucky? Is it up there? Let's hope so. Mouth. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> can't do better than that. Top answer. Whoa. Uh, surprising top answer, but top answer number less. Do you have an answer for us? Um, have a hard time closing. Book, lid, mouth. Shop. It feels like a rubbish answer. Okie dokie. But there's something you close. Shop. No. That's another strike. Oh. Um. Two answers remain. Uh. Reach. Really, really. Scraping the barrel here. Fridge. No. Ouch! Third strike. Fair enough. Really. We're throwing out a lifeline to the other family. So they could win it if they find an answer here. They'll steal the round. If this answer is up there, you take the points for this round. Window. Okay then. Well, yeah. Is that answer good enough? Window. Oh, okay, good. No. You're the big winner this round. What are the other answers? Let's tidy up those pesky missing answers. Let's see number three. Door. Show me the second most popular answer. Suitcase. Obviously. Show me those scores. Now you have trouble shutting a door. Anyway, it looks like we're going to play one more yeah, round. Yeah, well. Sort of going to sudden death. The winning team needs to hit 300 points. It's time to decide this game. Let's fly in the face of danger and play sudden death. Indeed. One person from each team. Come down and join me here at the front. <laughs> All 
All we need is the top answer. Whoever buzzes in first gets a shot at finding the answer. If you're wrong, your opponent gets a chance. We asked 100 people to give us an answer to this. Name a term used in a game of bowling. You're up first. Well, it's it's got to be strike, surely. Surely. That's what you think, huh? Show me that answer. Strike. Ah. It's there. You've won. Play you time family feud where you want to see a strike right there. So, we're going to fast money. Um so as I'm playing by myself, uh, I have to go through each one twice. Uh, it seems to expect you, if you're playing with two teams, um, to be watching the first team. Because you don't get extra time for second person to not duplicate answers. You actually get less time. So uh, so this works out. Give me the most popular answers to pile up the points. Since you're all alone, you'll be answering twice. You need to get 200 points or more to bring home the top prize. And here we go. Nine seconds, here we go. If you had a million dollars to spend, what would you blow some of it on? A uh, house. Name something in your kitchen you'd hate to be without. Uh, a fork. Name something you'd hate to lose at the supermarket. Wallet. Name a place on their bodies where even adults forget to wash. <laughs> uh, feet. Name a food that some people snack on while grocery shopping. We just don't do that in the UK, really. Um... Put sweets will that come up? Yeah, all right. We're all questioned out. I'm a bit worried because if it's an American game, but okay, we'll, uh, we'll see where it plays out. Do it all again. Time to step it up a gear. You're gonna answer them all again, but this time with different answers. Start the clock. If you had <coughs> a million dollars to spend, what would you blow oh, some of it on? Boring. Name something in your kitchen. Can't drive. Uh, I reckon cutlery is going to be catch all. So let's go with food processor, shall we? Name something you'd hate to lose at the supermarket. Phone. Name a place on their bodies where even adults forget to wash. Arms? I mean, I don't, but. Oh, maybe neck. Let's try Nick. Uh, delete, delete, delete. Name a food that some people snack on while grocery shopping. Um, uh, grapes. We're all Not a clue. Let's see how we've done. Not very That's happy it. with that, There's but we'll more see. We can do now. So, how for $20,000. Let's find out. Tension is mounting. First up, we wanted you to tell us if you had a million dollars to spend, what would you blow some of it on? Here's what you said. You should feel confident with these answers. We found the mm. most popular one. The next question. Suppose holiday was uh, probably going to be something in your kitchen you'd hate to be without. Here are your answers. How many points are these answers worth? Ooh. Ouch! A zip and a zip. Gosh. Oven. Oven. Fair enough. That would have given you the top points. Yeah, it makes sense. Next up, we asked, name something you'd hate to lose at the supermarket. And your answers? I think we might be good on this one. I think these are pretty good answers. All right. Hmm. We've got some work to do. Well, they lose my phone Number at the supermarket. Four, name a place on their bodies where even adults forget to wash. The answers to this one... I think we've got a couple of good answers there. 
We got mm? one good answer this time. The top answer? Ears. What? For the final question. Ears top answer. I'm not going to even go into it. Name a food that some Americans people are snack on while grocery shopping. What were your answers? And the final survey says. Oh, no. oh that's so a great. This is much better than I was anticipating. There you go. Great. Unfortunately, you didn't do well enough to win that jackpot. Looks like you won't get the twenty thousand dollars, but you still get some money out of this. We're gonna multiply your scores from fast money and all the other rounds and convert it into cash. And what does cash make? Is the big question. Thanks for playing, and I hope to see you again. And I'll soon. show you. It's Goodbye. customization options. <clears throat> Uh, here are the uh, Wanna give it another go? very very exciting things. We won't rematch, but here's, here are some credits for the show if you like. The Lee family, the pushover Lee family. Um, hosted by Lucky McCoy. Uh, imagine how much better their. Uh, Jeopardy with the fortune games to the been made. Lucky McCoy hosting. Look at these stats here, fast answer. High strike chain. High strike chain, that's not very proud of that one. Anyway, that's enough of that. Uh, let me show you customization very quickly. So uh, you get 10 avatars uh, you can change and buy things for. So, for example, this is all your money goes towards. Uh, if I want to buy my boy, my boy with new, new, some new glasses, or new hat, uh, this is what you spend money on. Um, so, if one's got a Viking hat, for example, costs 7,000. Oh. Done. All done. Easy. Um, all these uh, these cool glasses. Ah. All done. Easy. Uh, and that's it. So, customization options you can change sort of gender, body size, skin type, uh, face type. Eyes, hair colour, clothes, that sort of thing. Uh, if that's what you want to do with your life, uh, that is up to you. So anyway, that's I mean that's basically it. It plays a fairly decent game of Family Feud. Um, <coughs> uh, I would say as a warning, uh, this, this only came out yesterday at time of recording. Um, it was quite difficult to find someone to play. Uh, character is counter against. Um, presumably, there's not many games out in the world at the moment, but presumably that get a bit better in time. Um, but I don't know. Maybe no one will buy this. Um, I mean, I, I can't see much of a of a of an audience in the UK. Um, but they didn't have to release it here, and evidently, Jeopardy would have thought you must have sold some numbers to make it worthwhile. So uh, there you go, and, uh, and it's fairly cheap. Like I said, it's uh, 16 pounds of time of writing, um, which is much better than sort of the 30 quid they tried to charge for Jeopardy and Will of Fortune when they first released them over here. Anyway, uh, that's it for another Bobber's Bar plays badly. Uh, join us again for another one. Goodbye. <laughs>